What up everyone, Reege here for Animal Wire, and remember that time you thought it was safe to go back in the water? I don't blame you, cause how dangerous can it be with all them ocean bunnies running around? They got the little ears and the tail going on, so cute, sure, but these fuzzy looking critters are actually a type of sea slug known as a nudibranch. And since they don't live in the forest, but rather the sea floor, you betcha their body plan is going to be suited to the terrain. So let's take a moment and go through some of the features that really bring their rabbity persona to life. The most notable I must say are the two antenna like structures up top looking something like a pair of perky ears, but instead of sound they hit on different scents in the water, whether it be the smell of a ripe meal or perhaps a suitable mate. And those are two very important tasks, so increased surface area is really going to bump the reception up which is why they look all stacked and layered. And if you want to take that one step further, it becomes clear why their body presents itself as a furry hepo mass. It's covered in thousands of itty bitty projections that probably fill a similar sensory role. Now that's two down and one to go, so here's a hint. It's less of a bushy tail and more of a breathing apparatus. You guessed it, the animal's gills. And although hard to see, they're awkwardly positioned around its anus. Yep, I said anus, as in the opening that falls on the opposite end of the digestive tract. But that's not even the best part. There are tiny cilia on its gills that beat and flutter to drive water through, and this consequently forms an updraft to carry its fecal pellets away. It's kinda like a hydropower bidet running around the clock. So don't quote me on this, but the sea bunnies might have the cleanest bum in town. So really quick, shout out to Thomas B for picking one heck of a topic. And now I'm going to send it over to my friend Danielle, who can tell you a bunch more about nudie breaks. She's over at Animal Logic, so we've got the time, check it out. With that being said, yo dude, sweet creature.